Those overnight arrests near the home of Philip Seymour Hoffman, four suspects in custody, police trying to find a link to the actor's death. ABC's Cecilia Vega is here with much more on that. Good morning, Cecilia. Hey, Robin, good morning to you. Boy, a big raid here, as you said, in New York overnight. Police still trying to determine exactly how the three men and one woman arrested and all those drugs found are connected to Hoffman's death. Could this be the clue needed to find out where he got the drugs that likely killed him? This morning, four suspected drug dealers are under arrest after police received information during the investigation into Philip Seymour Hoffman's death and the heroin that killed him. Authorities finding more than 350 envelopes of heroin when they raided this apartment where the suspects were found. This as new details emerge about the final hours of Hoffman's life. On Saturday evening, a fan sees Hoffman and says he looks out of it. A few hours later, Hoffman talks to his longtime girlfriend, Mimi O'Donnell, on the phone. It is the last known contact he has. About the same time, a witness sees Hoffman withdraw $1,200 in cash in six transactions from an ATM over the span of an hour. That money never found in Hoffman's apartment. The next morning, Hoffman is found dead in his bathroom, a needle in his arm, roughly 70 bags of heroin nearby. Overnight, police confirming the heroin does not appear to be tainted with the chemical fentanyl, which has killed other heroin users in the past. This is uh, the scene of the movie where you help me out. Today, Hollywood grieves the loss of an actor some consider among the best in a generation. George Clooney telling Lara Spencer. He was a friend, so it's a, it was a surprise. It's unbelievable. Now, those close to Hoffman making plans for his funeral. O'Donnell seen here at a New York funeral home Tuesday. The minute the gun goes off, it'll be a bloodbath. One of the many questions left after Hoffman's death what will come of his role in the blockbuster Hunger Games series? And you have been our mission from the beginning. The actor had reportedly finished filming most of his scenes for the final Mockingjay Part 2, but still had one large emotional scene left. I, I have a couple of solutions to your problems. It's a hurdle Hollywood has had to overcome before, following the sudden deaths of stars like Heath Ledger and Paul Walker. Some Hollywood insiders reportedly predicting insurance companies might require actors to record various facial expressions in advance, just in case something tragic happens during production. Now that last Hunger Games movie is not due out until next year. Movie company execs reportedly saying no matter how they decide and, and do end up solving Hoffman's af absence, they promise that the film will be a true tribute, Robin, to this truly amazing actor. Amazing, Such a huge loss. talented actor. And yeah. Cecilia, couldn't help but last night watching you on World News and how you shared a personal story about how this affects you and your family. Yeah, you know, um, and what I've learned after sharing this, that my father was a heroin addict, my father Raul, who, who died because of his addiction, um, and we all miss him very much. And, and, and this, the response that has come out overnight has been absolutely overwhelming. And what I learned, my takeaway mm -hmm. in all this, so many families out there just like mine struggling and dealing with addiction and it's something you learn to live with and you know what you can you're okay you mm -hmm. can do okay his daughter's beautiful thank and what you. you have done and so it's just so thoughtful that you that you shared that so people know that they're not alone we're not thanks okay. thanks to see you. thanks to see you